you think about an England captain and you think, you know, there's question marks over Farrell, uh, whether or not he's the right guy in terms of his character. For me, Jamie George, the way that he conducts himself is in the middle of the scrum. He's guaranteed his place in the team now. He's media savvy, the way that he conducts himself in front of camera. I think he's a shout as well. Do you think not... Jamie George England captain? I, I, do you know what? I completely agree with you. The only drawback you've got on that is Eddie Jones has always backed Dylan Hartley, hasn't he? And he's like, if I now make the hooker that everyone craves captain... Mate, Dylan's done, mate. Surely. No, well, all he's got to focus on is the World Cup and getting fit for that. Mate, I can't. I'd love to see him come back. I think that, and again, we've spoken about it with Dylan, you know, controversy surrounded his career, really. Obviously missed out on the British and Irish Lions tour for telling Wayne Barnes where to go. Uh, injuries, bans or whatever to come through. Now he's the second most capped England player of all time. I just think the layoff that he's had and to be fair, if you look at it, where England are thin is probably at hooker. And that moment that Cowan Dickey in that line out in the game, which was so crucial, probably shows why you need a player of Dylan and his experience in there. But was was it Cowan Dickey's? I don't, I yeah, it was Cowan Dickey's. Uh, as a line out, it was his fault, was it? <laughs> <laughs> there needs to be a scapegoat. You know, sometimes it's the hooker, it sometimes, might have been sometimes the lift. It's the lift. Sometimes it, a second row never blames himself. He blames the lift all the time. It was throw. a timing. The hooker goes, you didn't jump high enough. It was a timing, Goody. Oh, yes, it was a timing issue. But for me, I, you know, I've seen pictures of Dylan uh, trolling them on Instagram. For me, he doesn't look like he's going to come back and play in the World Cup. And I'm saying that superficially in terms of he's fully clothed. And he doesn't look big enough. That, and, and it's a ridiculous thing to say. I think in World Cup, and you look how much the game's moved on in the last year, and Dylan's not really played a lot in the last year, has he? No. And you, and you think about how physical the game is now. England want to go out there and win it. As much as Dylan Hartley's done a fantastic job, is he the right guy to, to be filling a void in behind Jamie George? I yeah. don't know.